I'm holding a drawing for tickets to the Fathom Events North American screenings of Gundam Seed Freedom. Check the description for a link to the announcement and entry form. Drawing ends April 30th, and the screenings are on May 7th and 8th. Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flailthroughs, and this is the Gundam Battle Operation 2 PSN update for the week of April 25th, 2024. Uh, first off, I just want to, uh, before I uh, go through the update, I do just want to mention, uh, check the link in this video, which will take you to the giveaway uh, video for uh, tickets to the Gundam Seed Freedom showings that uh, Bandai Namco Entertainment America and Fathom Events are holding. Uh, I'm set up a Google form, you know, just uh, enter there if you uh, want a shot at uh, some tickets and uh, I will uh, draw the winners midnight on April, uh, on the uh, morning of April 30th. So Eastern time, of course, but just wanted to mention that link will be in every video between now and the 29th. So, uh, just, you know, good luck to anybody who enters now for this week. Uh, we have got the over on, which I believe is from, uh, uh, I think it's Gundam Walpurgis. Uh, it actually in that manga has a disguise that makes it look almost exactly like the O, but, uh, they've gone with the, uh, with the, uh, cast off mode or whatever you want to call it, uh, for, uh, GBO two. And it, of course, as a four star, it's going to have some fancy new abilities. I'm sure. Uh, we've got a half price 10 spin for the first, uh, step. And if you do all the steps, you get a uh, mobility enhancer custom part. Uh, also a limited supply drop for the new Gundam uh, FF and Sazabi FF, which I don't have either of those. I'd love to get them. Uh, apparently it is golden week in Japan. And so the uh, uh, hangers are powered up. Also, there's a, a separate golden week banner with another half price 10 spin, which uh, if you take it all four steps, you get a uh, higher chance of two star drops and all drops are mobile suits. And there is a golden week custom part uh, banner as well. Uh, let's see, I think I have most of those uh, overtuning parts at this point, maybe not all in the same account. Uh, I think composite frame type A is the only one I don't, but yeah. And it is the week of the update. So, uh, uh, the perfect Gundam should be nerfed and the engage zeros, uh, abilities have, uh, probably been corrected by now as well. So I'm probably a bunch of other things too. So it should be interesting to see, uh, this week in the DP store, Angelo's gear Zulu level two is uh, now available along with its weapons. And yeah, it's pretty good. Gu it's a pretty good, uh, suit. I know a lot of people favored the large Bruno gun Kai over the beam shot rifle, but they're both pretty solid. So it will, it should be a good time. Hopefully, uh, no new custom parts in DP. As far as I can tell this week, uh, the Alex Chobham armor level one is the uh, new thing. So I'll grab that cause I don't have it on this account. It's an interesting raid. It has the, uh, ballistic equivalent of the, uh, some of the beam coding abilities that uh, basically give it a lot of extra uh, ballistic defense and stun resistance until it hits 50% and then none. Uh, unfortunately, I don't believe it changes to the standard Alex model when it hits that 50%. I think that would be really neat, but uh, you know, I'm sure it would also be complex to uh, institute. Um, Hazel custom high mobility form and bound docker up today too. Nice. And level one excess. Yeah. Pretty good things in the store. I have, I just hit platinum. So I, uh, will see the full, uh, the full spread of possible things in the recycle ticket store. You may have a few less things if you don't have the platinum metal. So yeah. Um, any new custom parts? Uh, level five. No, it doesn't look to be, looks to be the, uh, Looks to be the usual things, but this, a level five parts can be good to have if you don't have them yet. New patterns? No. New markings? No. Okay. Uh, we will start with this half off spin and hope. Then we'll go to the Overon's half pr uh, price spin and hope. Really kind of have to go with the half price spins because they are just, you know, hands down the most cost effective uh, way to get stuff in the game. 
and you know you don't have the slight read ups of some of the other banners, but you know you still have the RNG, so you know hopefully the R will work in your favor. Well, I got at least one new thing in a level four harpoon gun, so that's good. I wonder what's level four that can use it. Ah, and another Thunderbolt Agai, which I think I may have all three versions on this account now too. So that'd be cool. I do like the Agais. They're fun. Um, I hope we do get another Gundam Thunderbolt movie uh, some t or series sometime soon, just because it's... I, I've kind of... It's grown on me, and the soundtrack is fantastic. It is definitely... A, you know, a lot of people compared it to Cowboy Bebop because of the soundtrack when it came out, but it's... It is definitely a different kind of jazz than, than Cowboy Bebop, but just... Eh, that's the kind of music I, uh, my dad listened to a lot when I was growing up, so I've got a soft spot for various kinds of jazz. So it's 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 nice to have the variety, honestly. Um, and I just got a bunch of repeats, so... And, yep, more repeats uh, uh, coming, and... Uh, some mechanic tickets. Yeah, so I got a few new things. I got the level 2 arm beam saber. I don't think I have a single level 2 ag eye yet. Like I said, I do have all of the level one ag eyes at this point, I think. So, and let's see, that's full price, that's half price. Okay, let's try this and see if I can get the over on. Uh, regardless as, uh, as to whether I get it on my personal accounts or not, there will be a test drive video uh, up probably about 11 a.m. this Thursday. Okay, well, we're starting with a gal. That's a good sign. We're starting with a gal. That's a golden crate. That is level two Gundam Mark IV. It's not. It's not entirely new. I have the level one, but I'm not going to hold that against it. You know, not not getting repeats is just. It's a good feeling. You know, entirely new things is, of course, the best feeling. Uh, repeats of uh, some of the level two Code Fairy stuff. Uh, beam saber further enhanced. Yeah, that's for the. Uh, Geo 5 booster, I believe, which is why it's red. Uh, level 4 Gear Zulu, which ha was fully maxed out on its enhancement points, so none of those. Uh, Dolmel Beam Saber. Still don't have the Dolmel Doe. I don't know that I know anybody who does, so. Man, I was hoping for the comedy value of that just dropping for me after saying that, but the. You know, I, the gotcha not playing along is kind of uh, the nature of the gotcha, so. But if there's something else uh, comedic it could drop on me, I'm hoping we'll see it happen. Uh, long blade rifle, that's not very funny. But again, at least it's new. Uh, nope, repeats. Yeah, so uh, those are my spins for the moment. And yeah, not bad. Uh, looking forward to seeing the uh, details of this uh, month's update because it's always fun to see what gets buffed. But at any rate, that is going to do it for the GBO2 update for this week. We will be back soon with more. Till next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later! <laughs>